hi friends welcome back to my channel thank you for tuning in again with me in today's recipe i'm bringing you an interesting video you are going to see how mustard oil is made at home mustard oil has so many health benefits it is used to promote hair growth it's very good for dandruff it gets rid of dandruff premature graying and itchy scalp in this very video, I'm going to show you how to make your own mustard oil at home. So I urge you to stay tuned and watch this video to the end and see how this oil is made. To make mustard oil, you will need dried mustard seeds. So I have here 270 grams of mustard seeds. So I'm bringing this into a pan. You first of all need to toast the seeds on heat first. I'm going to be toasting my mustard seeds on low heat just to prevent it from burning. Toasting this helps to increase the amount of yield you're going to get at the end. After toasting the mustard seeds for 5 minutes, you can easily hear the sizzling sound. At this point, I'm going to stop toasting this. I'm going to bring it off from heat and leave it to cool down. Once the seeds have cooled down, I'm going to bring this into a blender and start blending this right away. Once I'm done blending, I have this smooth paste here. So I'm going to turn it over to a bowl and blend the remaining. I had blended it in batches. Once I've had all the seeds blended, I'm going to bring this into a pot. The next thing I'm going to do is to add some water to the paste. And I'm adding another cup of water to this. This is about 800 ml of water. Make sure you stir the paste to dissolve everything in the water. So next I'm placing this on the stove top and I'm going to place the lid over the pot. Okay guys, so I've allowed the mustard paste to boil for 10 minutes and I've been stirring this as it boils. So at this point, I'm going to turn off heat and allow it to rest for a little while. I'm going to strain this over a cheesecloth placed on a strainer. So I'm just going to gather the material and try squeezing this. This is quite hot. When you're dealing with this, please be careful so you don't have to burn your hand. So I'm just exerting a little force to release the water from the paste. Next thing I'm going to do is to bring this filtered mixture into a shallow container just like this. So I'm just bringing everything into it and I'm going to place a lid over it. Then I'm going to place this in the fridge. So guys, after four hours of leaving this in the freezer, 
the oil has separated from the water the water is down while the oil is floating at the top all i'm just going to do i'm going to use a spoon to scoop the oil float thing at the top so i'm just going to carefully remove the oil just like so just make sure you are able to scoop as much as you can so once I'm done scooping I have my mustard seed oil here but it's mixed with water all I'm just going to do I'm going to turn this over into a pot just like so and I'm going to place this on heat for the water to evaporate okay the mixture has started boiling you can notice the oil floating at the top so I'm going to allow it to boil and the water to dry up completely the sizzling sound has stopped it means the water has evaporated from the oil so i'm just going to turn off heat when you are doing this make sure you are cooking this on very low heat you don't overheat the oil mustard oil has a very strong taste and a pungent smell so this is the oil we have gotten from 270 grams of mustard seeds it can be used to promote hair growth you can mix your mustard oil with wax to treat crack heels and also it can help to treat brittle nails mustard oil has anti-inflammatory effect you can use it as face mask it helps to treat acne and also any other skin infections and also it helps to improve your complexion so this was how to make pure mustard oil at home so guys let me know what you think about this homemade oil because I used 270 grams of mustard seed, I got about one and a half tablespoon of mustard oil. If you need more of this oil, you can increase the quantity of seed you use for your extraction. So this was what I got. And let me know your suggestion. What do you think about mustard oil at home? If you're new to my channel, please subscribe and share this video with your friends. And until next time, I'll be expecting to see you very soon. Bye for now.